All right, got a couple of Slickster setups to run through. Uh, the Slickster was originally designed to be a minimal carrier, but it can go from overt to covert. So we kind of wanted to show that off a little bit. Uh, this one's got the dope up front. Uh, you can stack inserts. So we've got a triple 5.56 kangaroo insert uh, with the kangaroo small pocket. Uh, you can also use the half pocket and then run some pistol mags on this side or this side, whatever you kind of want to do. Um, the advantage here is modularity. Uh, you get a ton of extra space uh, and you can kind of configure it. It's got an internal divider, pull that out, change things up at will. Uh, it's a little bit thicker than our other uh, front flaps, uh, but what you gain in thickness, uh, you also gain in modularity, which is pretty sick. Uh, I've got a full-size dangler at the bottom, great for medical equipment, um, as well as like breaching supplies or just extra space for maybe spare comms stuff, uh, whatever it is, fits great. Uh, the dangler's got kind of this U-cut at the bottom. Uh, this stops it from bunching up. Uh, and we run them inside the plate bag, gives you a little bit more of a streamlined fit. On the side here, you have the wingman uh, with a radio. You can run extra mags. Um, it's just an el elastic uh, pocket, right? A little extra pocket you can put at the side. Uh, we mostly run radios. Uh, it fits things like the 152, the 148, MPU-5, uh, all fit in here. Got the PTT retainer holding our push to talk up here. Uh, pretty simple design, just some shot cord uh, with some nylon in the middle. Uh, to keep that PTT in place. Uh, one cool thing we came out with this year was the uh, CEC side plate adapter. So the Slickster comes with the Carry Elastic Cummerbund. Uh, we made an adapter so you could run six by six plates uh, with this Cummerbund. Uh, pretty cool solution. Uh, they, these just come on and off with Velcro. Uh, you don't lose any of the space uh, in these cells. Um, so you don't really need to take this off. You can kind of put it on, leave it on, uh, just take the plates off. Um, pretty simple solution if you need that extra level of protection. Uh, on the back, got the Roll One. We designed this alongside Ford Observations Group. Um, it's just ambidextrous, right? So you can put it on the back at the front, uh, grab it with your right hand, left hand, pulls out uh, nice and easily. Okay, second Slickster setup's got the kangaroo front flap with the kangaroo triple 556 insert. Uh, the kangaroo front flap gives you that molly up front. So you get a little bit of modularity, chem lights, pouches, uh, whatever you need. Mag in the carry elastic cummerbund, as well as a radio and your mini dangler. Uh, you put med supplies uh, in it, uh, a tourniquet down at the bottom in the elastic. So pretty streamlined. Great for law enforcement, or if you were doing a lot of training at the range, you just want the bare essentials, uh, but you wanna be able to scale it up pretty quickly if you need it, great solution for that. All right, last Slickster setup, super minimal here, uh, kinda how we originally intended the Slickster to be run, uh, slick. No front flap, uh, this is great for putting, you know, like a jacket over top, no bulk, added bulk up front. Uh, also awesome for something like a police officer who wants an active uh, shooter uh, plate carrier to put in their trunk. Three mags on the side. Uh, we've got our radio in the carry elastic cummerbund. So you could fit a pretty big radio in here. Um, it also fits the Motorola's as you saw on the last one. Uh, PTT retainer. And then on the back, we've got our roll one. Uh, so you always wanna have an IFAC with you. Uh, nice having the roll one, like I said before, ambidextrous. So super slick setup, really affordable. This is, I know a lot of people wanna put stuff on their plate carriers, but this is a great place to start. Uh, you can get a lot of stuff done with just this setup.